What's going down, YouTube? It's your boy, Freddy of the Craft Beer Nation, once again with another quick beer review. On the menu tonight is a beer from Monkish out in California. Where in California? Torrance, California. This is Mon Mon Monkish Brewing's Foggier Window. This was canned on the 21st, so we're a little, about three weeks old now. It's open right away. Uh, a lot of, uh, if you don't know about Monkish by now, you live in, when you're into craft beer, you're living under some kind of rock. Might help if I pour it and let you guys see what's going down here. It's a nice long stem. Holy, super, super cloudy, hazy, murky, turbid, opaqueness. Check out the glass. I don't know if you guys can read that, but it says tickers, got a tick. Pretty dope. Uh, yeah, anyway, I love the glass beer already. I can smell it. It smells crazy, but appearance wise, guys, like I said, can't see through it. Typical that Northeast New England style IPA head is dissipated very, very quickly. Very like off white. Kind of looks like if I can uh, rip it up a little bit. Yeah, man, but this just off white, loose bubbles, man. But as usual, murky. This aroma is just filling up the area around me. Ridiculous, man. So might as well get a nose on it since I'm smelling already. Oh my god. <clears throat> Smells like Smells like Whole Foods organic juice. <laughs> yeah, man, just grapefruit. Like peach. It's like a smells like like guava, passion fruit kind of. Smells like a tropical juice mix, man. Straight up. Oh, incredible guys incredible smell seriously the, the way these breweries are doing these beers now from now coast to coast it's crazy man there's a lot of do guys there's a lot of people doing it right a lot of people doing it not so right but monkeys definitely knows what the hell they're doing man they they obviously because they've been consistently putting out some really good beers so i cannot wait to get into this guy so cheers man Let's see what it's about <laughs> wow. <laughs> Damn. That is official. Wow. <laughs> it's grapefruit. <laughs> it's like like stone fruit. Oh, again, it's like that there's like a guava in there kind of there's like kind of little like a tropical fruit like it's a guava like a passion fruit or something that's giving it a little like kind of changing the citrus vibe from it oh you know what I'm so excited this is a uh, 8.1 abv got to mention that but uh 8.1 this thing drinks silly good Jesus. Wow. Monkish, man. Cheers to you guys. You guys definitely know what the hell you're doing. It's incredible. It brings it with with the, this. Literally, man. You, you hear everybody say it's juice. juice. That's what it tastes like. It's it's hard to explain anything other than that. That doesn't sound like you're doing it over and so repetitive. That's what it is, man. But at least in the back end, it's, again, it's got that like nice touch of, of, of bitterness. It makes you feel like you're drinking a beer again. A little bit dry. Um, I wonder if, I don't think, yeah, I didn't think so. I'm not sure what hops are in this. It's got a, I wonder if they use like a, like a dextrin or something. Kind of just, and not by taste, I mean, because it has like a slightly dry finish. Okay, man. Wow. This is official, dude. Oh my God. 8.1. I mean. I don't know if I could just destroy a whole bunch of these, but I would like to try because I know I'd be wrecked, but it drinks so good at 8.1% that you would get the, <clears throat> excuse me, you'd get the impression that you could just start. If you got a four pack, you're like, yeah, this, it's going down. You could try to drink all four. You probably could, but yeah, you'd be feeling nice. So um, as far as the rating goes, guys, uh, oh my God, look at that thing. It's just nice. It's just 
Are you serious? As far as the rating goes, um, I mouthfeel, it's creamy. Uh, this is actually ridiculous, man. It's hard for me to say like what's wrong with this beer. And I can't really think of anything off the top of my head. Usually it's like, boom, it's missing this or that. Nope. So in that case, five CBN caps. This is hundreds on hundreds on hundreds, man. This is it's a damn good beer, dude. World class. It's monkish. You guys did it, man. You brewed a winner with this bad boy. This is beautiful. Yeah, man. Five CBN caps, guys. If you can trade for monkish, if you live in their torrents or surrounding areas. I know the monkey slimes can get crazy, but excuse me, uh, well worth it in my eyes. Uh, definitely trying to get your hands on some of their beers, especially when they brew. I'm not sure how often they brew this, but if you see this one go by again, you definitely got to go to brewery, pick it up because I think it's five CBN caps and it's certified GAF. Good as fuck. With that said, ladies and gents, this is Craft Beer Nation once again, and this is Monkish Brewing foggier window coming in at 8.1% ABV. Give us that five CBN caps. Don't forget to smash the like button down below. Subscribe, share, and let us know what you think, guys. As always, cheers.